Hey guys, it's Elaine, the Ninja Life Coach, and welcome to my channel today. Today, I'm going to be reviewing this little number from I Am Wigs. So sit back, grab yourselves a cup of coffee. I'll be right back. Hey everybody, I'm back, and I was sent this wig that I have on by I Am Wigs to review. Now, I will drop a link down in the description box to this wig so you guys can take a look at it and let me know what you think. This wig came packaged with this. I mean, it's a nice box. It was a little, it was crunched a little, but that was because of the shipping. My stuff has been arriving that way lately. It also came with this cool little necklace. Look at this, isn't this cute? I was so happy to get this. I love jewelry, you guys, but I thought that was cute. Now, I don't know if this is something they sent me for reviewing the wig or if it comes with every wig, but that was just a cute little added bonus. Now, the box is really nice, and what I really like about it, not only does it come with a wig cap, it also comes with a little silk scarf. Whoa, look at this, look at this. I thought at first, I thought this was a silk bag to keep your wig in, but look at this, isn't this pretty? I love this. They have just gone way up in my estimation. And it was packaged in this. The wig came, I was very impressed with the packaging of the wig. Now, let me turn around and let me let you all see the wig all the way around. It's got a cute little flip in the back. And there it is. I love the way these layers right here just kind of fall around your face. Now. When I first got the wig and took her out of the box, the, I had to shake her really good and work the fibers loose to get her, you know, to looking like this. She didn't come straight out of the box and, and I plopped her on my head. I did have to work with her a little bit, but I didn't have to steam her, I didn't have to cut her, I didn't have to do any of that stuff, but I did have to work my hands through her to loosen up the fibers, which that's okay, you have to do that on a lot of wigs. The fibers feel nice and silky. Um, they have a good feel to them. So let's go online and let's take a look at the specs of this wigs and we'll just see what she's got. Be right back. Okay, so here is the picture of the wig on the website. Here it is. And there's a picture of the cap. If you go on, take a look at that and see. Now they do have a page, uh, let me look at this. They do have a page on Instagram. And if you want to follow them on Instagram, it's I am wigs. So follow them for more details and more things that they have going on um, with their wigs. Now this particular wig is described as a short wavy layered red brown wig. Now this wig is much more brown and gold to my looking at it than it is red. But um, there are you know, there are a few red highlights in this wig. This wig right now, today, I'm making this video on August the 15th, uh, 2003. The wig is $89.99. The color is R630H. It is an average wig cap, 22.5. This wig is large on me because I have a little head. So if you have an average head, you probably will be able to wear this wig. It's large right up in here. I do have her cinched down a pretty good bit. Um, I would probably have to go in and mess around a little bit with the wefting to um, just kind of pull that down just a little bit, but I don't mind doing that. I, I have to do that with a lot of my wigs, but let me turn around again. Let me let you look at this wig. Now, let me talk about the fibers on the wig. The fibers feel nice and soft. What I would compare this wig to, the fibers on this wig to me feel similar to fibers from the wig company. This is about uh, a wig that's about on par with wigs from the wig company. So if you need a point of reference, that's a point of reference for you. If you've ever worn wigs by the wig company, you will know exactly what I'm talking about. This wig does have some permatees up here on top, which that helps give it its shape. In fact, it's got some right in through here too, which is okay, I don't, I don't really mind that. Let me read the description. This is a basic wefted wig cap. Um, it's synthetic, um, light density, which I would really have to take an issue with that. This is not a light density wig. This is a heavier density wig, and I am probably gonna go in and 
thin it out just a little bit right in here because it's heavy right here. But that's okay. I, it's not like that's nothing that I've ever had. <laughs> it's not like I've never done that before. Uh, the product weight is 3.8 ounces. It ships within 24 hours after processing except weekends and holidays. Delivery time is anywhere from 3 to 15 working days. Um, 30 days free return in exchange with hair not being used. Um, so it sounds like that they have a good return policy. Now, let me just say this right up front. This is my first time reviewing for this company. This is a review of the wig, not the company. I can say though, out of being, uh, contacting them and going back and forth with them over, you know, the wig and what wig I wanted to review and all this stuff, I got my wig within a week after I first told them which wig that I wanted to review. I got my wig fairly quick, and I think that they may possibly send me another wig to review. Um, the guy that I spoke with said, you know, that he would like to, and so I may be reviewing more for this company, but I will tell you this. I don't know anything about this company other than the, this wig, and I think the wig is definitely worth the price. I think this wig is worth the $89.99, which is what it's selling for on the website. And they also have, it looks like there's a membership that you can join and you can get um, coupon codes if your order is over $70 or $129, $199 or $299. Now, when I look at the website, so let's just talk about the website just a little bit. Um, they have wigs on sale. They have wigs that are $55. Uh, percent off. They have wigs that are anywhere from $50 to $100 in that zone. Now, they have other wigs that are more expensive, but they have a ton of different wigs. Now, I was contacted by this company via email and on my Instagram account. So, that's how they contacted me to ask me to review the wig, and I was happy to do so. So, the wig is as far as I'm concerned, I think the wig is worth $89. I think the wig is cute. I think the wig is would be easily styled. If you didn't want this to curl towards your face like this, you could very easily steam that back, or you could easily tuck this behind your ears and have just a little, just a little piece showing right here. You could do that too. That would that's very easy to do. Now, as you can see, my ears kind of poof out a little bit with this because this wig is large on me, but that's because I have a pin head, not, <laughs> I don't have a normal sized head. So let me put on a head wrap and let's just take a look at this wig and see what it looks like after it's accessorized just a bit. I actually wore this wig on my live in my Facebook group um, last night, which would be Monday the 14th. And um, I got some good compliments on it. People liked it. So here we go. Let me put this on, let's, and I'll be right back. Here she is, let me turn around and let you all see this. I just threw this on, and look how cute this is. She is so sassy and just really a cute, cute little wig. Um, I think one reason why I love this wig is this reminds me of the very first wig that I ever had, which I call Frederica. She is a no-name wig as well. And she is worn out and frazzled. The old girl has been through <laughs> dynamite and has survived. But I really love her, and I will never, I will never get rid of that wig unless you know the dog chews her or something. I am going to keep that wig and probably, you know, <laughs> be <laughs> cremated with the wig. But this wig is just a cute, cute little number. I really, really like it. It's an adorable little wig. Now, let me put a caveat on here. One thing I will absolutely do with the wig before I wear it is I will spray it with some dry shampoo because the wig does have a little bit more shine than I like. I don't want it to be dull because my own hair is dull. I don't need dull, but I do want to knock some of the shine down off of it just a little bit because the wig is a, a fuzz shiny for my taste. That's all right, it's not anything big. And for $89.99, and if you, you know, sign up to be a member for them, it looks like that you can get even, even more. When I clicked on the website, there was a coupon for 15% off that popped up when you enter your email. So that may be something that you might like. So if you want to follow them on Instagram, it's I-M, like the letter 
Imagine, and then Molly <laughs> wigs. And you can get all the details that you want from them. And I don't know if they have a YouTube channel or not. I may need to look that up to see. But the wig does have bendable ear tabs. Um, let me try to think. The wig cap is just, it's just a basic wig cap. There's no monofilament. There's no lace front. There's none of that. This is just a basic wig. I like to review basic wigs. Now, don't get me wrong, y'all. I love, love, love the monofilament, the lace front wigs, and this company does have them. This just isn't one of them. But I also like to, to review wigs that are in the $80 to $150 to $160 price range. And the reason why is because not everybody can afford a $300 wig. Take a look and let me know what you think. Oh, I got my wig quickly and I like the wig. Now, is this going to be a $500 Ellen Villa wig? No, it's not that. That's not what it's designed for. This is a good basic wig for you to wear and make you feel good about yourself. It is not going to be your high-end wig. That bothers me zero because I don't care about that. I care about when I put the thing on my head, how does it make me feel? And despite it being kind of a brown, I actually like myself in this wig. The more I look at myself in this color, the more I'm like, you know, you can wear that color. And I really do like the wig and I love this style. I think this style is really, really cute. And if I had a criticism of the wig, it would be, it's a little shiny. And that's all I have to say to criticize the wig. I don't have anything else to say about it. Um, the fibers feel good, nice and soft, easy to zhuzh up, and you know me, girls, I live in Dolly Parton country. The higher the hair, the closer to God. So, I like a poofy wig, and I cannot lie. Just speaking from strictly an experiential perspective, my experience has been very positive, and I like the wig. I think this wig fulfills a niche that is very, very needed right now. Right now, the cost of wigs have, it, the cost has really increased over the last couple of years. I hear that all the time. I see it in my wig groups and everything is more expensive. Mary Kay has had an increase on their, on their prices, on their makeup. So it's everywhere. So I think providing a product that is affordable for people and a product that people like and enjoy, I think it's really, really important. And like I said before, not everybody can afford a $500 wig and not everybody can afford a $300 wig. I'm not one of those people that are just, that's, that's like, well, you need to save your money and get the, the $500 wig. I hear that a lot, but let me tell you something. People who say that have never lived on social security and they have never worked at McDonald's as their primary income source. Because if you've ever done one of those two things, there is no, let's save our money because It'll be 10 years before you get a $500 wig. And a lot of times the need is immediate. So you may be able, you know, people may be able to afford a $90 wig or a $100 wig. That's just my thoughts on this. And, you know, y'all know I love cheap wigs. Y'all know me. I love wigs. I, I don't care if the wig is $20 and I don't care if it's $2,000. If I put that thing on my head and I feel good about Elaine, the Ninja Life Coach, I am a happy camper that day. I do like the wig. I think it's adorable. I think it's cute. So let me know in the comment section and be sure to check out their website. If there's any, if you have any questions, please don't ask them because I don't really know anything other than this is a cute little wig. I've given you all the information that I have about any of this. Be sure to check out their Instagram page. Follow them for to see what all they got going on. Their, their page is pretty cool. So hope you all have a wonderful day. God bless you all. I love you guys. Okay, so let's take a look at this scarf. I forgot all about this. This is a nice big scarf. Look at this thing. Whoo wee. Y'all know I love scarves and I love head wraps. So with this being kind of a silky feel, I would probably wear a, if I wanted to wear it around my head, I would probably put a wig grip on underneath this on the outside of my hair to hold it in place, or you can always just simply wear it right here.
Isn't this pretty? I love this. It's a beautiful color. It's pink. So Mary Kay to the rescue. So yeah, really, really like this scarf too. God bless you all. Bye-bye.